Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening, I'm glad you're all here. I want to say thank you to the channel members. Thank you all so much. I appreciate you more than you know. And I want to thank any of you who come in to watch my knife, my EDC, my crazy purchases, just all the weirdness of this journey I'm on. I appreciate you coming to watch. If you really want to do me a huge solid, if you'd hit that subscribe button and that bell notification icon, it'll really help me out and keep you updated on what goes on with the channel. So this looks just kind of like a big burly flashlight, but it's not. It is the big brother of a flashlight I reviewed a while back, and I'll try to put a card that shows where this flashlight is in this video. But this is the LEP DX Reach Revision 2 by Meritac. And the LEP is an, a laser emitting processor. So it's basically has this very large single bulb. For example, if we look at it compared to the light that we had yesterday, the focus works. The lights look totally different because you just got that big cavernous laser. Then if we look at this light that has three floods, it still looks a lot dif different because you've got just this one big laser head. And we'll get into that in a second. And then like we did with the other video, I'll kind of go through some specs. I'll try to get you some more detailed specs than I did in the last one and some measurements and stuff. And then we'll go out and we'll shine it and come in here and break, break it off. This guy can either be powered by an 18650 or a 21700. I've got a 21700 in it now. It comes with a sleeve. I picked up a couple of extra ones of these and some of these little cases from Amazon to keep them in. But uh, it also comes with a sleeve that allows you to run an 18650, a little narrower battery. The reason I like the 27 is it's going to give you the most throw, it's going to give you the most time with the light, and it just fits the light, right? So I always have a backup. It is a, um, so a dual type of beam. Like I said, it comes with that, that inset. When you turn this on, you've got low, low, strobe. low, high, all right, so that's low, that's high, and then you just soft push it to strobe it. So low, high, low, high, two pushes, strobes it. So that, in a nutshell, is the type of light you get. What it does is it throws, or canela if you want to look at it that way. The throw of this light is what's so impressive. It's rated to throw 6,300 feet. We'll go check it. I live across the street from a cemetery. We should be able to light up down the road. And that's roughly a 1.2 mile beam. So I should be able to hit the houses across the cemetery. What they claim, that I don't know how I can test it, is they claim that you can turn this on and it can be seen from 42 miles away. So it's that bright. Because again, it's a blue laser that's emitting and changing into white light through this lens here. So... The other cool thing about it is it's water resistant down to about three meters. It's got some really nice knurling here on the, on the handle. Um, it's got these trit slots. It came with these little uh, glow rods, and I immediately got the sizes. They're three millimeter by 11 millimeter and ordered some trit and some UV glue, and you won't see it on camera here. Maybe you'll see it outside when we go out in the dark, but I've got pink, blue, green, pink, blue, green, trit vials in the back. And um, what else does it use? 
Yeah, the emitters are manufactured by a third party, and they're like 0.25 watts, high output. Um, so they basically follow the same type of classifications as a laser device does. So let's do a couple of quick measurements on this guy, because it is a bigger light. It's not a pocket light. It's a bug out bag light or a truck light. We're going to call it five inches. It's like five and an eighth at the widest point. It's about an inch and a quarter in the center, closer to an inch. We break out our calipers. See about an inch there, up at the thickest part. You know, 1.2, and then by here back at the back. 1.24 and while we've got it out and batteried up we ought to get a weight on it and then we will go outside and we will shine it with the battery it's 6.15 ounces so it's not a light boy all right guys what we're going to do is we're going to pack our light up I'm gonna see y'all in just about two minutes, right out there. All right, guys, that's the Apple's phone coming on. So first, we're gonna just give it a little, a little shine. That's shining at the ground, shining at our tree. Low, high, low. That's low. That's the neighborhood over across the street. Let's see if you can see that. Let's go to high. And that's the kind of throw that we've got. Our mailbox. And you can turn it on the strobe, and evidently that can be seen by anybody. But yeah, guys, let's go inside. All right, guys, that's it. That is the Maritac. Got a little bit warm. The Maritac LEP DX Reach. High is right there, which looks like a small little ball, ball of light, but that ball will go, you know, quarter mile. And then we've got the mini. That's low on the mini, low on the DX, high on the DX, high on the mini. So they're super bright lights, both of them are. But I hope you found it cool. Different than a flashlight, it's an LEP. But guys, thank you for spending the time with me. If you made it this long, thanks for watching me shine them outside. We didn't look at the tritium outside. Let's see what happens if I turn off these lights. There you go. Now you can see the tritium. Got green, blue, pink, green, blue, pink. So there's our trick, guys. Forgot to show it to you outside, but I showed it to you inside, so we're winning anyway. Guys, thank you, thank you, thank you for watching my content. I appreciate y'all more than you know. Love each and every one of you. I ask, please, look out for the guy or gal to your left. Look out for that guy or gal to your right. Look out for one another. Go forward with love in your hearts. Choose debate, not hate. I love you all. Peace.